So in this particular tutorial, I am going to discuss how to create GUI for graph plotting. So first of all, I am opening the GUI builder and from GUI builder, I will use some push buttons and axis to plot some waveforms. So I will plot sine wave, I will plot cosine wave, I will plot random wave, I will plot tan wave and I will show you how to plot it. So I am beginning with the sine wave. First of all, I have selected the push button for sine wave. I will select it for the cosine wave. So I will write the tag and then whatever name or string written on that particular uh, button I am writing. So it is second button I have added as a cosine wave. After cosine wave, I will use another push button for tan wave. So I am writing here the tag for the tan wave and I will write the string also for the tan wave so tan wave as a uh, tan wave written as a string okay so I, I have plotted it I have drawn it and last it is uh, for random wave so randomly uh, the wave will be generated so I will show you how to create the random wave so four push buttons are selected and that waves will be displayed on the axis so that I will draw it axis later. Now here you have to align it properly. You have to adjust the width. You have to adjust the length of the buttons. So equally you can add. So this is nothing but equally spaced. Then you can make them as an equal height and equal width by clicking the buttons over the alignment. Now it is now equal width and equal height and they are aligned. So uh, you can select single button also for changing the uh, things. Now I'm drawing the axis. So I have selected the axis and I have written the tag as well as the string for that string for it. Okay. Now I have drawn. This is the axis I have drawn. Now whole GI is complete. I have drawn the axis where I will plot the graphs and I have drawn the push buttons. Now I will generate the GUI. So click on generate and uh, save it the, and GUI is created. So this is the GUI created by using the GUI builder. So this I can close that GUI creators. So I am clearing it. Okay. Now to execute it, click on that run button. So this is nothing but actual GUI where you can work on it so sine wave this is nothing but sine wave cosine wave buttons now i am clicking on it but there is no output so to get the output i must write something into the callbacks so this is nothing but a callback related to sine wave this is related to cos wave so i'm writing for the sine wave so i have taken one variable x 0 to 2 pi and uh, i will plot the sine wave into the axis so I'm writing y is equal to sine of x y is equal to sine of x now I will write the plot plot x comma y now I'll, I will execute it again save it and execute it close it yeah, sine wave. Now, if you click on sine wave, because I have written something inside the sine wave, and because of that, it is showing the sine wave. But if I click on any other button, it will not show anything because I have not written any function or anything inside the callback. Now, I'll write for the cos, I will write for the tan, I will write for random one by one. So, I will just copy it and paste it, and I will change it. Copy it and paste it. So instead of sign, I am changing it to cos. Now you can see whether I am getting the sine wave or not, as well as cosine wave I am getting because I have written it. Now I, similarly, I will change it for tan. I will change it for random wave. So I am copying it and I will paste it into the other callbacks. And instead of that, I will write it as a tan. And in random function also, I am I will change it as a R A N D. Now save it and 
compile it, run it. So it is random wave you are getting. So you can zoom it. So close it. Once again run sine wave, cosine wave, then random wave. But in this case, this is nothing but tan wave. The tan value is so big and because of that sine and cosine wave we are not uh, or it is not possible to see. Now I am changing the style of display. Suppose I am changing it to red and dash for the sine wave. Click it, execute it and see it is now the dash dash or red dash. So I can also change it for the uh, red star. So there are various styles I have explained in the previous tutorial. So you can see from there. So this is nothing but the stars, red stars. So you can change the display style also by putting some values. Now if I click on sign, if I click on cos, so the previous value or previous thing remains as it is. So if I want to click, if I want to click on sign, it should play uh, display sign. If I clicking on cos, I must uh, have only cos wave. So for that purpose, I have to clear the whatever earlier plot drawn so that I will use delete function. So delete handle dot means the handle dot access plot dot children. So access plot. So it will clear the whatever drawn earlier. So I'm clicking on cos. If I click on cos, the earlier sign wave will go out because I have written into the cos function. Now I will copy it everywhere so that uh, while displaying it I will copy it and I will uh, paste it into all the callbacks so that whenever I am clicking on that particular button I will get only those that wave which I want. So previous wave will be deleted or it will be cleared. So this is nothing but all about the plotting of the waves.